class weight. Added minutes has been indicated. 
Rafinha. And it's Sergio Roberto. And we hit half time. So they decent game up to now. What have we learned from the first 45 minutes? Yes, they're behind, but it's a, a reversible situation. As long as better defensive focus can, can avoid a second goal on the counter, they know they have the wherewithal to come up with what they need. Napoli, we're in at half time with a slender one goal lead. We're probably into the second 45 minutes. Napoli going well here and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. That's a good intervention. That was what he had to make in the face of danger that was growing. Threads one in. Ossiman. Oh dear, less said about that pass the better. Nice little ball through. Lewandowski. Lewandowski unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Napoli finding their passes. 70,987. Elmas. Di Lorenzo. Plays a sharp little. Can he put it away? comes the cross Kessier Zielinski Real chance here. He's gone down, but the referee just tells him to get back up again. Played out towards the right wing. Kessier. Footballing with usually identifies with running room, and we've just seen a prime example. He can get that clear. Barcelona really are showing all the necessary urgency, but it's potency they need. Osimen. Zielinski. No, it's not getting there. They may end up with some regret with this tactic, but you have to admire their commitment to goals. Rafinha. it out of harm's way but they've got it again Rafinha Barcelona need to give it everything they have kitchen sink included Napoli just have to run down the clock referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle